Okay. Hey y'all. My name is Jesse. And um I think I might be a little bit too close. Uh but this is gonna be a new channel. My name is Jesse. We're gonna be talking about Western stuff. That goes from boots, hats, coffee. Um and yeah, so let's jump right into this first video. Um well, it's about 11.45 at night. Um, it's kind of late. Um, but I wanted to go over my, uh, my boot collection. From my favorite pair of boots to work boots to, you know, what type of boots I like. You know, that kind of stuff. So, we're going to start off with my oldest pair of boots, ones I actually don't wear no more, and these were made in Guatemala, handmade, um, I think I bought these boots for, you know, 20 bucks, something, they got a leather insole, looking down in there, you can probably see it, a uh, rubber outsole, it had a heel, stacked leather, it was small, with a leather cap, I mean, uh, a rubber cap. So they, these boots are, you know, just regular leather, all the way to and through. Um, but I don't wear them because they're falling apart. They're a little bit small. And, uh, yeah, that's basically why I don't wear them no more. They do got a smaller square toe. Uh, and yeah, so those are my oldest pair of boots. Now my second oldest pair of boots. That could be these. These are snakeskin. These were given to me. Um, I don't care for the riding heel. I don't like my arch being up more. I don't. It, it's too high of a heel for me. Um, the leathers. I mean, yeah. The snake python is kind of nice. Uh, so, you know, other insole, leather outsole, uh, rubber caps, leather stack, heel. It's it's your basic um, dress up python, J toe, classic cowboy boot. This one does have a rip in it. I don't know if y'all can see that. But it does have that rip in it, which stinks, but it is what it is. And these are my favorite pair of boots. These are boots I wear on a daily basis. Okay, and these are these. These are a boot made by Horsepower. Um, and they are a Cayman <clears throat> leather outsole. A leather outsole, a uh, goat hide. These were made in Mexico. These are 10 and a half D. Again, made by Horsepower. The style number is HP1842. Got that blue with the uh, top stitch. You know, very nice boot. I love these. These are super comfortable. I love the heel. Actually, need to get them half sold. Because if you can see there, it's actually um, starting to rip. And so yeah, these are very comfortable boot. My favorite boot um, by far. I do everything in those boots. Whether that be go out to the ranch, uh, you know, whatever. It doesn't matter. Now, these boots are not a cowboy boot. These are a work boot. These were given to me. These were my grandpa's boots before he passed away. And I was given them. They're work boots, steel toed. They're by Carhartt. They're leather. Got a really nice insole in them. It's a really comfortable insole um, by Carhartt. This thing's really comfortable. It's got a memory foam. And so, by Carhartt. Um, it's 
So yeah, these boots are really comfortable. I'm going out doing a construction job. These boots are waterproof. They're very comfortable. They obviously weren't conditioned good before I got them, so you know they do good. Good for our heels, our soles. And then my last pair of boots that I want to talk about. My last pair, my newest pair. I just got these a couple days ago, actually. And these are an ostrich skin, full quill, kind of piece together, ostrich uh, leather shaft, you know. Again, the riding heel, leather soles. These were, these were given to me by the same person who gave these to me. Um, these are 10 and a half D, I mean, a 9 and a half D. Sorry, these are a Nakoba boot. Um, so yeah, like I said, I don't really care for this type of feel. Um, J2 is alright. It's a classic cowboy style boot. Um, it does got a taller shaft. This shaft, I think, is about 13 inches. So, it's probably about 13 inch shaft. Um, and so yeah, so those are my boots. Um, and yeah, I just kind of wanted to get on here and talk about boots and that kind of stuff. Talk about what I like. Um, so yeah, uh, the coffee that I'm drinking is by Black Rifle. They are a coffee company based out of Utah, Salt Lake City, Utah. Um, they are a veteran owned and operated and ran business. Um, you can actually see that right there. If it'll focus, I don't know if it is. This one's a just decaf because like I said, it's almost midnight. But they do have other ones like that. Is a this one is okay it's not labeled for it's on a box somewhere probably in the trash I just ain't got it so like I said this one this week it was just have an intro just to get to know me um and look at my boot collection i plan on expanding my boot collection i'm actually gonna get these half sold here in a little bit so i'll show you that whenever i do um and so yeah that's really it and uh well I'm going to sign off of here. Y'all have a good night. I got to go to sleep. Because I got work in the morning. And so. Uh, hope y'all have a good night. And good day.